All right, I'm here to bring you some uh, good old Canadian rock from my youth, um, mainly because I haven't actually seen this version of the song. This is Billy Talent live at the Rock M Ring, Rock A M Ring, however you pronounce it. I always got confused by that. Anyway, from 2009, Billy Talent, Try Honesty. If you like how this band sounds, well, try some Canadian music. Anyway, here it comes. This has always looked like one of the most fun European venues to play at. Um, I believe it's in Europe. Anyway, this just, just looks like so much fun, this stadium. You'll notice with this band the harmonies that they have and stuff. And like, um, nice to see bands, you know, actually playing their instruments. But uh music of even like what? They performed this in two thousand nine, but I think it came out a few years before that. So like, you know, late nineties, early two thousands music, like things have changed so much and I miss it. There's a lot of um, mention of religious stuff in his music because, well, it's a source of trauma for him. But, um, yeah, I've always liked this band. They're really fun, especially live. They put on a good show. Like, look at that crowd. That's insane. <laughs> These festivals and everything are like, will be so much fun to be there. Well, it's a good idea that when you're in a toxic relationship with somebody to finally, that feeling when you finally cut that cord, it's like, oh, I'm free. <laughs> The way he's uh, standing on the amp and everything, I love it. Um, he always does that when he performs. You know, it's going to allow you to hear better, but also be closer to the crowd. Yeah. 
Yeah, now comes the screaming part that a lot of people love so much. And I do too. I think it's um amazing that transition between the two, you know, between the melodic vocals to the screaming. It's really well done. I also wanted to know with the screaming that you can actually hear what's being said. You know, a lot of times when artists scream and stuff, you can't tell what they're saying. But with last thing you'd use for Pete's sake in a song. crowds into it. I'm sure we've all seen a concert like this where like the crowd is just sitting there bored and you can tell when the band's not doing a good job but yeah these guys get everybody into it. The break is probably needed for the singer to uh, regain his composure before the next thing, get his breath back. I remember two years ago, in 2007, we had the privilege and the opportunity to play here at Rock and Ring. And I remember thinking to myself, that that was one of the best days of my life to be able to play in front of so many people and have so much fun. I really wonder, I, I, I'm pretty sure that that style of accent that he's using when he speaks is not his natural speaking voice, but I really like that um, voice he uses when performing. It's great. So many people and have so much fun. But I can honestly say that tonight is by far the best experience that I've ever had playing live in front of anybody ever before in my life. Don't you love it when bands say that at every single show that they play? <laughs> you guys are the best ever. Oh yeah, I forgot. It is. It's in Germany. I forgot. Pardon me. <laughs> it's a great little speech there, though. Thanking the crowd and everything. It's also like that friendliest mosh pit in the world in the middle there. Maybe that's the Canadian thing. I don't know. But They're just such a good, solid band, you know, performs really well together.
All right, so that was uh, Billy Talent, Try Honesty Live, 2009, Rock and Ring. Let me know in the comments what you thought. It's a you come and be informant. Has a fun too. Fun too. There's only 